Hello everyone and welcome to my cooking channel. What you making Dave? Today I'm making some lovely pretzels. I've already gone ahead and used my Bobby Flay pizza dough recipe slightly modified. I added two ounces of butter to it to make these lovely pretzels. I've got some boiling water here which I put in some baking soda which we're gonna lightly blanch our lovely pretzels. I've already rolled them out into uh, longer tubes and now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna twist them and get them in the water and into the oven to show you how easy it is to make your own pretzels. Alrighty, so we have our first one here, and we're going to put it right into the water. And while that's cooking for about 45 seconds, I'm going to make the next one and get them all ready. I'm going to do them slightly different, so you can see the different styles of pretzels that I'm making. So that's the second one. Now on these two, all I'm going to do is I'm going to keep twisting it and twisting it. And then I'm going to bring this forward like that and pinch the other underside of it. And then pinch a little bit here as well so it stays together. And then I'll do the exact same thing on this one. And then bring them in. Pinch them just like that, and a little bit like that, and I'll have a little fun with this little one. Just for fun. Now I need to flip this lovely pretzel. So you're going to notice it expands a little bit, and that's how you're going to know it's uh, finished uh, blanching on the one side. So we're going to count to about 30 seconds now, and once we're done, we're going to take this out, put it on the baking tray, and uh, afterwards we're going to put a little bit of egg wash on it and a little bit of Himalayan crushed pink rock salt, just to give it a different look. So now this one's almost done. Say another 10 seconds there. And let it drain out a little bit. And onto the baking sheet it goes. Then we'll take our second one, lower it into the water, and to reduce some time, what we're going to do is we're going to put our little guy in there as well. So it's about 45 seconds on each side. And then after we are finished, with the blanching part, we're just going to take a little bit of our egg wash here, and just go over it a little bit. And then we're going to take our Himalayan pink salt, grind a little bit up there, and all done. So what we're going to do is we're going to flip these now. And do the other side for about 45 seconds. So you see how they puff out there a little bit. So when they reach about one third larger than the size that they were to begin with, you know that they're uh, pretty much done cooking. Now this little guy is going to be done fairly fast before the big guy. So we'll take this one out. 
and just slide it over here. Just another couple seconds for this large one. And we'll flip it over and repeat the process for the other two ones. Adding a little bit of egg wash and Himalayan pink rock salt. All right, now that we have that one done, just drain a little bit of the water here onto the baking tray. And then we will put our other ones into the water. And be careful when you're putting your hands into the water. I mean, my hands are almost uh, immune to the heat now. But uh, keep in mind, this is extremely hot and you might want to use a brush. Alrighty. So, we're just going to turn it down a little bit. Alrighty, so about another 45 seconds. We're going to take these out, let them drain. A little bit of egg wash on, a little bit of pink Himalayan rock salt. Throw them in the oven for about, uh, I don't know, 14 to 20 minutes, depending on how well they brown up, at about 425. So now we will take these ones out of the water. We'll be careful not to break them. on these two. Keep in mind they are very hot. A little bit of my pink rock salt. Now what I'm going to do is throw these into the oven and we'll be right back to show you how they turned out. Welcome back everybody. The pretzels are done. First attempt looks absolutely incredible. What we're going to do is we're going to break one apart now to see how nicely it is done. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Click the bell for notifications. And voila. Here we go. Oh. Absolutely perfect and buttery. That is so hot. I'm going to leave that. Don't forget, <laughs> subscribe to my YouTube channel. Click the bell. Thanks, everyone, for watching.